You going to come see the Barbie movie? Yeah. Do you love it? Do you love Barbie? You say I want to go and see all the ladies. Good morning. It is early. I dropped off Lucas at the vet because he's getting his teeth cleaned today. And now we're gonna make some eggs. My dad got some farm fresh eggs, so they're the best. Look at how pretty, you get all the colors. <clears throat> eggs. Today we are having a big, big filming day. So I figured I would document what like an actual giant, very busy day in the life is like. I'm more of a like do one or two things a day and like get those done and plan ahead so I don't have to do like 97 things in a day. I have like 30 minutes to get ready because I need to film like two videos before Devin gets here and then we're gonna film our podcast. We're gonna do TikToks and like that's gonna be probably an hour or two of stuff. And then she is going for a couple hours. I need to go to Ikea, get some shelves. I need to film another two videos. I also need to go to HomeSense. And then she comes back. We're gonna record another podcast. And I might have a date later, but like I'm probably not gonna go on it because like if somebody doesn't check in the day before a date, I have no interest in it. I have no interest in it. I'm sorry if it's weird, but I need to know that like you actually wanna talk to me leading up to a date. Anyways, two eggs, gonna scramble them, feta, salt, pepper, and I ground up some new coffee beans yesterday. Look at how bare that is. We're officially out of extra coffee. Now we just have TL the actual asshole. Okay, we are going to Ikea, which I hate. I hate it there. It makes me so anxious and so sad, um, but I need some shelves for the laundry room and then we need to go to HomeSense because I need some like containers for the laundry room. Devin just left, she's coming back later. Uh, we filmed the first podcast and we did a YouTube video. So I'm gonna do this little outing, probably grab some lunch and then come back and edit. Good morning. It is actually the afternoon, but the next two days are gonna be really, really like run around, do a bunch of stuff. So I figured let's just hang out and go do all the air and things together. I decluttered my room for the like seventh time this summer. Does anybody else find, I'm just gonna sit down on the ground for this little chat. Anytime I'm super stressed out, I just declutter. Anytime I feel overwhelmed, I declutter. Anytime I feel stressed with the, like just events going on in my life, I declutter. So I did that to my closet again. Got rid of a big bag of clothes I'm gonna take to Play-Dohs tomorrow. But um, I also have old bedding and a bunch of clothes that like I know Play-Dohs won't take and um, some old kitchen stuff and like office stuff and just like a bunch of trash that I want out of the house immediately. And I feel like, my room's in a good place now. I'm gonna show you, but I wanna go and drop that off. I wanna run into the thrift store really quickly and see if there's any kind of like artwork. Um, and then I wanna go to either HomeSense or Marshalls because I need socks and I'm kind of redoing my little like couch filming setup. Not hugely, but like I filmed with Devin the other day. You'll, that's actually the last video I posted and it looked so busy while I was editing. So we're switching it up. So first of all, got that out thrifting, beautiful. Um, also washing my bedding, so ignore it, but it just looks so nice and cleared out. And then my closet, like I got rid of so many clothes. And then I've just got a couple jackets and some dresses, bags, shoes. So I'm trying to just declutter shit. Okay. So I just dropped off like a lot of shit at Value Village and I'm I'm not even gonna go in. I just like, I am so burnt out and I wanted to just have a little vent sesh. So that's what we're gonna do. Cause I do still have to go to Marshall's. So I'm just gonna vent for a minute. Okay, okay. I feel like I'm just so emotionally burnt out with like <clears throat> just everything and I need a minute and I, I just, it's just a lot and I feel, I feel it. So this week is really busy and I can't really do much about it this week, but I literally next week I need to like book a hotel or something because I need to just like have a night 
a full day, a full night where I am alone and I don't talk to anybody and I can just like watch sad movies and do nothing and I just, I just, I just need it. I just need it because I feel, you know, when you're so overwhelmed that you're like, if anything happens that's so small, like my pocket could get caught on like my kitchen drawer, I would start crying immediately. Like I just, I need it. I need it. Tomorrow's going to be a good day. I'm going to go to Plato's closet and drop off the clothes that can probably be donated there. I got rid of some bedding. So like I have space. I'm going to get my hair done. I'm going to get underarm Botox because I have been sweating like it's literally no one's business. Okay. I literally went to the happiest place on earth, the place I was yesterday, HomeSense, to uh, see if there was anything that would work and this is how you know I'm in like a fucking mood because I just was so indecisive and I couldn't like figure out how I wanted it styled or what tones were gonna work. Hello good morning we are going to get my hair done I'm in so much of a better mood than I was yesterday so bless up for that um yeah dropping off the donations yesterday I'm glad I didn't end up buying anything for the room. I got in curtains though, so I will kind of show you me tweaking it a little bit today. But first we have things to do. Hair done, gonna go and get this taken care of. So here's the before. I'm gonna stop and get a Starbucks. Guys, look at the hair. It's so pretty. I'm so into it. The toner, she said, because I wash my hair so often is gonna wash out in like a week, which is fine because I like this for a minute and then I like it a little bit toned down, but it is so much more blonde, higher uh, shadow root, which is exactly what I wanted, and then just like shorter face framing pieces because as we know, I've been wearing my hair up a lot. And now I am going to get Botox and drop off clothes at Play-Doh's closet and then go home and my dad and my mom is apparently also there also so both my parents are coming over to help me install some floating shelves because I am just but a woman with a feeble brain and um, also put up a cabinet in the garage and the way I just almost got fucking sideswiped I <laughs> I had to like move off the road into the fucking what, what is this what is this the ditch because this person doesn't understand how to fucking check their blind spot. And yesterday when I was in my grumpy mood, I was like, I'll honk at anybody. I don't give a shit. I'll honk at anybody for anything. I didn't end up honking at anybody. But there was a little satisfaction that I was able to like beep, beep, beep. Okay, just dropped everything off at Play-Doh's. It's a big bag of like Zara and the Bay, like young adult designer shit. So... I'll probably get like five dollars. So I put up the curtains. This is what it looks like now. I want to get a piece of art for right there. And then, it, I, I don't know, I think it looks cute. I would like like maybe a rust colored throw blanket or something, but I like it. I like it, it's so cute. And then any other art, I'll just kind of expand the gallery wall. Look at this big bag of garbage, dear God. This is what the laundry room looks like right now. We couldn't do the shelves because there aren't studs here. So I need to repaint it because the paint I touched up with is newer, obviously, than the other one that's older and discolored. So you can tell where I painted it. So now I just gotta do the whole thing. But for now, this is good. This is much better than where we started. The bedroom. Lucas had, he has little shaved areas. He keeps licking. It just, it looks good. And the closet, the closet looks good. The closet looks really good. These are all the clothes that I have, except for the winter stuff that's under the bed. Can we just look at how cute Lucas is being right now? Are you being the most handsome boy? Jack's like, excuse me, what the fuck? <laughs> so me and my new blonde hair. I like it so much. Um, I just did robe curls and it's second day hair and you can't even really tell, which is lovely and the goal. Um, we're gonna go and mail out 
this is my little box for my OnlyFans person who buys me a bunch of shit off of Amazon. So he gets my garbage. <laughs> and then this is a Amazon return that I bought and he also bought and I didn't know he bought and so I bought and we, I am returning mine. This is what my dad put up yesterday and now it has all of our like summer outdoor stuff. And then he put up bike rack. Guys, I've had this cough for weeks and it will not go away and it's getting so much worse and it's so fucking annoying so i'm gonna go to starbucks and get a uh, honey citrus mint tea because that always soothes me it soothes me i have been living on cough drops last night i was up i went to bed so early and i took nyquil but i was still up five hours after i had gone to bed after i put baby down and it, I just I can't sleep like it's awful and it's always like the tickle you know and then it's like it's like dry and it makes you cough and it just sucks